baby bus. Runaway toys. Nikki, a baby monkey, has lots of toys. There was a rainbow ball. He was throwing and bouncing it. Boing, boing. Rainbow ball rolled under the couch. Ah, <sighs> that's no fun. Nikki took a monster truck from the toy cabinet and played with it on the couch and on the floor. Vroom, vroom! Monster truck is coming! Bang! Monster truck crashed into the table leg and stopped moving. Nikki then began reading a picture book instead. Sitting, then lying down, he grew bored soon and threw the book onto the table. <sighs> when Daddy Monkey asked him to put his toys away, Nikki ignored him and went off. On the following day, Nikki took his toys and books out again. He scattered them all around the room, in the corner, under the couch and desk. That night, Nikki was woken up by someone's voice. Huh? Uh, who is that? Not knowing what was going on, Nikki crept out of bed and looked around. It was his toys talking. If I have to sleep in the corner or under the couch again, I think I won't be able to stand it. That's not so bad, Rainbow Ball. Look at me. I have bruises all over. I can't even get any rest in the toy cabinet. Ouch. It hurts even when I talk. <laughs> Nikki is so bad. Monster Truck, why don't we just run away? Right. Let's go find a new owner. Just then, the picture book on the table spoke up. Can you take me with you? I don't want to be here anymore. Me neither. Me neither. I don't want to be here. Me neither. All the toys wanted to leave Nikki. Nikki was so afraid that he called loudly to them. Everybody! Realizing Nikki was awake, the toys began to run away. Nikki had to call out more loudly. I'm sorry! Please don't leave me! I promise I'll put you back in the toy cabinet from now on! Huh! I don't trust you! Let's go! The toys didn't trust Nikki. They just kept running. Bam! Oh no! Picture Book was in such a rush that she fell down. Nikki went over to her and picked her up. Picture Book, I'm sorry. I threw you on the table. I'll never do that again. Would you forgive me? Um, uh, okay. All the toys stopped running when they saw this, except Monster Truck and Rainbow Ball. Bang! Ouch. Ugh. Monster Ouch. Truck's wheels were stuck. Ugh. He couldn't move. Nikki walked towards him with picture book in his hand. Monster Truck, I'm so sorry. I'll treat you better. Can we go back home now? Uh, all right. Now only Rainbow Ball was still running. Boing, boing, boing. Rainbow Ball bounced down the hallway. Nikki ran for the ball with Pitcher Book and Monster Truck in his arms. Rainbow Ball, Rainbow Ball, please wait. I'll never, I'll never leave you under the couch again. Can you come back and play with me? Boing, boing, boing. Boing. Rainbow Ball stopped bouncing. 
It's time to wake up, Nikki. In the morning, Daddy Monkey was waking Nikki up. When he raised the blanket, he saw a picture book, monster truck, and rainbow ball. Nikki, how many times have I told you? You need to put your toys back. Yes, right away. That day, Nikki got up early and put away all of his toys and picture books. Hi, kids. Don't forget, put your toys back before you go to bed. Bye-bye.